Welcome back to Magic Tarot Cards. It's Jasmine. I have your June 2024 lucky lottery numbers. These numbers are given to me by spirit. So try your luck. I'm not a magician. I can't make you win. But these numbers are as close as you're going to get to the real thing. So try your luck. All right. First, I'd like to say this video is not made for kids. If you're under the age of 18, please click off now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. So you'll be reminded when I upload another video. I want to discuss an issue real quick. Last night I did a live video and a girl came on there and took one of my videos and put it on her page. You are not allowed to do that. Okay. You're not allowed to use my material for your revenue or to put it on your page, make money off of it. Okay. So I've contacted her or I've tried to contact her. All her comments are off, but I did file a copy uh, right infringement uh, report on her and I'm going and I've already contacted my attorney to sue her this is very serious for me this is my work my job you're not allowed to use my content period if you're watching wife 222b you're no longer welcome on my page all right so get off my page don't use my material. Take down my video. I've already made a video for you asking you to take down my video and you, and it better get done. All right. Period. There's no, there's no question about it. Take down my video or you're going to have a huge, huge, huge lawsuit on your hands. Not to mention the other things that I can do. You do not know me. You do not know what I'm capable of. Take my video down off your page. Period. Now let's continue with the numbers remember the numbers come from spirit they are not my numbers that i'm giving you they're spirit numbers i hear them i see them and they whisper them to me so the first ones we're going to do is water signs if you're a water sign you are a pisces cancer scorpio what do you see for pisces cancer scorpio for this month i'm seeing the number two and the number four remember they do not come in order I write them down as I hear them. All right, I need number seven. I'm hearing number seven. Lucky lottery numbers, number 16. For water signs, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, I'm hearing number 37. I need another number, please, for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. I'm hearing the number 12. Now, do you have a bonus number for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, June 2024? What is the bo I'm hearing 17. 17 as a bonus number. So we have 2, 4, 7, 16, 37, 12, and bonus number 17. Or you can use any of these as a bonus number. All right. Next, we have Earth Signs. Yeah, Earth Sign, you are a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. All right. So I need numbers for June 2024. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What do you see for Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn? I'm seeing the number 27. 27 and 23. What do you see? I'm seeing 43. Sometimes they come quick. Sometimes they come quick. I'm seeing 17. What do you see for earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, Cap number one. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, lucky lottery numbers. I need 15. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I have six here. Do you have a bonus number for earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, 22. They're saying 22. All right, and number two. They're giving me two bonus numbers. Four earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Try your luck. All right, try your luck. Do not use my videos for your revenue. It's a warning. There's a fly in here. Uh, these darn flies, they get on my freaking nerves. I've killed them. I've, I've tried to, I got a fly catcher. You know, I swat them. I have spray and they still, every time you open the door, a fly comes in. Like they just, they make me sick. All right, June, 2024. Lucky lottery numbers, fire signs. If you're a fire sign, you're an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Give me numbers for Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Right away, I'm hearing the number six. The number six, I'm seeing the number four and the number 44. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Number two or 22. Two or 22. 
22 or 22. I'm going to put them both down. Lucky lottery numbers for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius fire signs. Show me another number, number 11. Now, what is the bonus? What is the bonus? Do you have a bonus for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius? What do you see? I'm seeing a number 777. Seven. Number 7 is what I'm hearing. Number 7. So we have 6, 4, 44, 22, 2, 11, and 7 for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. This is for June 2024. June is my birthday. I have a birthday at the end of the month. Okay, next we have air signs. If you're an air sign, you are a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. June 2024, lucky lottery numbers. What do you see? What do you see? I'm seeing the number 37, 37, and 43. 37 and 43. I'm seeing the number 13 and 17. These come quick. What do you see for lucky lottery numbers for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius? I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. I don't know why I said that. This is for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Air signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. My mind gets twisted sometimes. Number eight. I'm hearing number eight. Do you have a bonus number for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius? Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. What? Bonus? Bonus? Bonus number four. Number four. Okay, so you have 37, 43, 13, 17, 8, and four as the bonus numbers. You can always use these as bonus numbers as well. This is for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Sometimes I get tongue-tied. All right, I'm going to do a bonus read for all the elements, water, earth, fire, and air. Okay. First one is water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What do you see for the month of June 2024 for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio? Oh. Show me one more for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right, so. Yeah, we're going with that one. So I'm seeing, first of all, money is moving slow. This is the hope of money, money coming in. But if you notice, the horse is standing still and he's not looking at our direction so that means he's standing still he's in stagnation the writer has a coin in his hand the yellow in the background meaning this money is going to be fruitful bringing good things but it's slow moving money it's coming in very slow all right so try to do things to manifest it to come faster i'm seeing an x return for water signs pisces cancer scorpio this was an x that Hurt you by a third party. Because if you see, and if you turn it in the upright, the, the sword stabbed the heart. There was three people here. It caused much depression. Oh, this is grave, crying, depression. But it's in the reverse. So that means he's coming back. He wants an apology. He wants to apologize. He's coming back to mess with you a little bit. I would not accept this person. Because they are not sincere. Anyone that carries a sword energy is not sincere. They're just playing around to see what else they can get from you. I hear them saying this this was not supposed to happen. Oops, it was an accident. It was a mistake. No, cheating is never a mistake. It's never an accident. If you mean to do something, you do it. You either do or you don't. There's no in-between and lifetime. For some of you females, they're like, well, he didn't mean to do it. He was drawn up. But block me. You either do or you don't. There's no in-between, no maybe or no nothing. Either you do or you don't. If There's no if, this or if that. All right? So then we have the card of defense. I'm seeing your name being thrown around. Gossip. Um, this might be at the workplace or, you know, around people you know. I'm seeing you're going to have to defend yourself. You're in deep thought about this. And But guess what? You have the advantage because the man is standing on the hill, so he's able to poke down. I'm seeing several people here poking up at him, but he still has the advantage because he's on top of the hill. Defend yourself if you have to. Most likely you're going to have to defend yourself in the month of June against a group of people. All right, so be careful with that. That was for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. I am a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, so huh, we'll see who comes in. All right, 
Next is Earth Signs. Tank is over there in the corner. What are you doing, Tank? I think he's humping his teddy bear. <laughs> um, yeah. Show me Earth Signs. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Earth Signs. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What do you see for Earth Signs? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Show me Earth Signs. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Earth Signs. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right, Earth Signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I'm going to go ahead and pull this one as well. So I'm seeing, uh, actually this came first. Let's put them this way. Um, I'm seeing for Earth Signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, the Wheel of Fortune is in the reverse, so your luck is in stagnation. You don't have bad luck, but you also don't have good luck. It's in stagnation. The Wheel is standing still. I'm seeing also your money situation is standing still. You're not making or profiting as much as you thought you were in the month of June. I see that you worked hard to get there. Here's the work you put in. You have your coins stacked up on display, but it's in the reverse. So that means stagnation. You didn't make the profit or whatever it is you thought you were going to make with the work you had put in. I'm seeing due to illness or injury, there's money loss, maybe a job loss, either with you or someone around you might've hurt their foot, their leg, or some kind of illness. See how the person is barefooted, meaning poverty. So this injury or sickness or operation or whatever it is that you had or the person around you had caused them to lose money. Maybe they got put off work, haven't returned, and their money got low. All right. So I'm seeing that you're feeling that life is roaring in like this lion. Life is just coming in and it's too much to handle. But guess what? You're able to shut the mouth down of life. See how the maiden is shutting the mouth down of the lion. The the lion represents life coming in. And then you have yellow in the background representing a brand new day. The infinity sign is above her head represents a lasting, long lasting. So you will get your strength back. Things will come better by the end of the month once you shut things down. Get your perspective in order and you will come right back up. That is for Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Next we have, um, I'm not sure who's texting me. Next we have um, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody is texting me. Y'all, my laptop is still broke. I still haven't got a new one because I've had a lot of money issues. If you'd like to donate to my channel, please do so. The cash apps will be in the disclaimer box down below. If you're not sure of anything, read the disclaimer box. You are not allowed to copy this video and use it for your revenue for any reason. If you don't want a huge lawsuit on your hands or me to cast a spell on you, because that's what I'm, I'm fixing to do that, do not use my video. All right. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, I'm seeing someone coming in. I'm also seeing some type of addiction for you. Spirit is the one that pulls these cards and tells me which ones to use. Some people get confused because there's only some that I use, some that I don't. But Spirit is the one that tells me what to do. I am seeing, um, this one was first, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio coming your way, offering you love. If you're not involved already, this is either for you, someone near or around you is coming in to offer love. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, this is actually a good thing. You see how he's leaning in. Look at his feet. He's leaning in, offer, extending his hand, this cup of love. And I see you or someone near or around you offering it. Deep thought. This person is in deep thought. And the infinity sign, again, is here, meaning it's going to be a good thing. I am seeing... Uh, something rewarding, something victory, some type of victory coming in. But here's the thing. Um, this is a double-edged sword, okay? So that doesn't mean the victory is going to be solid. It could flip at any time. So be careful whatever you're trying to be victorious over because it could flip and go the wrong way. I'm seeing another person that was either in your life or 
or um yeah someone from the past in your life that was like a father figure maybe they were a provider someone that had a lot of money but that is in stagnation for some of you remember this is general it doesn't mean it's for you if it resonates with you it's for you if it doesn't then it's not meant for you all right so uh, the uh, someone that was a family man provider had money no longer wants that or this the relationship or situation is in stagnation i am seeing someone with addictions they're addicted to alcohol or drugs or to another person you see how the people are chained to each other and then they're changed to chained to him this little devil here i don't like looking at his face now this person has serious, serious problems. You see how he has lit their tails on fire. So this is something serious. So someone you or someone near around you or someone you're dating or someone around you has these type of issues. Be careful with this person. All right. That was for fire signs. Aries, Leo. Uh, Aries, Leo and what? Sagittarius. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm getting confused. Um, the last one is Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius for air signs. Y'all, excuse me if I get tongue-tied. I, ha I have a lot going on in my brain. <laughs> this is for air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. There, that one fell out, as you can see. Show me air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Whoa, oh, oh, here we go, here we go. First card is falls is the first card I see in use. Show me, if you want to be a true tarot card reader, you have to have the ability to know what you are doing. There's a lot of false people on here that cannot read the card. Pick up the card. Okay, do you know what the colors are, the position of the hands and feet? What does the background mean? Uh, if they cannot explain any of the scenery or what these people are doing, then you're not a true tarot card reader. You're fake. All right. Show me. You're just a wannabe, all right? And yeah, I said it, I said it, I said it. That one's going to go too. All right, so Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Again, I'm showing that you have to find your strength. Here's a strength card. You feel like life is roaring in. The maiden is shutting the mouth down of the lion. Your, your good things are coming when you get a grip of your life. I'm seeing an unexpected event happen. What happens when these people fall down they fall to their demise this was something unexpected so this is something that's already happened or might happen to you or someone near or around you i'm seeing much depression with this card something you weren't expecting happens these people fall to their demise this is not a death card but it can mean death for some people or some type of ending so don't think you're dying Unless you die. <laughs> but this does, could mean that. But I don't see death here. So this means some type of ending coming because of an unexpected event. Which causes to lose money. Maybe the unexpected event is loss of a job. Loss of money due to an illness or a sickness to you or someone near or around you. Will suffer this this month in June. And will lose money because of a sickness or an illness or a loss of job or money i'm seeing the opportunities that you had that were had come in fell through this is the seven of cups with the uh, opportunities coming in from heaven on this cloud there's a whole bunch here but also the warning is be careful which cup that you choose we have the dragon the snake and then a cup that you cannot even see if you choose one of those then you end up like this meaning that you did not pay attention to detail okay when you're offered something you have to pay attention to detail any clause what's the clause is there a clause in the contract you are not looking at you're you didn't read the whole thing so it caused you to fall in this position where you lost everything or lost things or now you're in a contract that you wish you hadn't signed. Here is, or maybe it's going to happen. If, if it hasn't happened yet, then pay attention. You got a chance for it to not happen if you pay attention to detail. Why? Because the judgment is here. This is the angel waking up the people that are asleep. This is the aha card, the great awakening card, meaning, aha, uh -huh, now I see. So you're going to have a great awakening this month. It could be about all this here. Uh, the angels blasting his horn saying, pay attention, wake up, look at what you're doing. So I am seeing a great awakening here, a moment of clarity 
clarity. You're saying, oh my God, I did not realize that then. Uh-huh. Okay, it's a great awakening aha card. That's what they call it. All right, y'all, that is it for now. Thanks for watching. If you want a person reading, contact me with the text message, with the number, text me in the disclaimer box. I no longer do emails. You have to text me and I will get back at you. All right. The, the, um, yeah, my readings do cost, but they're not that expensive. So thanks for watching. Again, you are not allowed to copy my material for any reason. So stay out of trouble. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>